Hello, everyone. This is Faltos. The return of Laser Bridge. Playing the return of Laser Bridge. And I basically want to be a little smarter in terms of, uh, you know, just be wise. about my movements and stuff. You know, not be in, in enemies' ways, you know, take advantage of their attacks to get, get in your own, etc., etc. Don't overdo it. That's another thing. Okay, yes, fire is very good against these guys. So basically, as you can see, I'm being a bit smarter. I'm not overdoing the amount of opponents, etc. I'm keeping my eye on things so I don't don't get overwhelmed by enemies. Making sure to dodge stuff if I can. That one I got bounced back on. Whoop! See? Just, you know, be smart about things. I think these guys are weak to fire too. No, they don't have any weaknesses. Okay, well. Fire tends to be the more offensive based one. Ta da! So there we go. Much better overall. Just, you know, being intelligent. Blocking when I need to, dodging when I need to, etc. Just keeping my eye open on things. I'm sorry I have to talk about the seahorses again. Did you actually notice they sound like horses? Seahorses are not related to horses. I repeat, not related. They just look similar, but that's it. There really is a lot more water here compared to Autumn Rise. I suppose they wanted to raise the difficulty. Remember, everyone, water is deadly. Yes, it is. And you just smacked a guy, so I guess I'm fighting them. Whee! Into the water. Uh oh. So this is what I mean. I gotta be I gotta be careful. I gotta block what I need to, etc. Uh oh. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! Alright, stopping. So that's what I mean. Just fight a little bit, take out some enemies, and then stop. Let your HP recover. Don't don't overdo it. That's basically the wisdom I can give people who who play this. It's like just, if you're gonna fight things, prepare yourself, and don't overdo it. Ah, I got, I got interrupted. Oh, you're chilled? Time to burn you. Alrighty. So yes, as as was mentioned, they're raising the difficulty of the platforming as well. There's gonna be a, a lot more chances that I'll fall in water, etc. Around here. Hey guys, I found the thing I'm looking for. Your journey has taken you across these signs of prosperity long past. Seeking your next destination in the wilderness to the north, you must first accomplish the trial of these fields. Pursue the path of the luminous creature and prove your mastery of the elements acquired. Traveler, envoy of change, will you accept this trial? Nah, okay. Let your every step form the path of your growth. Whoa, rad bunny! Look at that bunny! Here comes the bunny, that annoying bastard. Hush, Emily, don't spoil it. No spoiler, just looking at it jumping away. We all know it's gonna be annoying. Yes. This is gonna be a little much, but let's see if I can handle it. Alright, let's see if I can't take this guy. Oh, no, I hit the tree! Of course I hit the tree. 
Oh, that guy's gonna cause me problems. I'm gonna run away. All right. Oh, hi, bunny. You uh, interrupted my battle there. Uh, okay. Works for me. Ah. Uh, uh, oh. Hey, look at that. I countered. I countered a, a guy on respawn. Okay, I'm heading over here. Ah. You followed me. Here's two guys who I think are both uh, away from comp at the moment. Okay, yeah, it's gonna stop, recover HP, etc. Ah, I see we're back in the ancient ruins of Puzzle Village. Still serving puzzles even thousands of years later. So yeah, the, we got some doors here, windows. Gonna have to angle a shot into that hole right there. I, um, did this little guru mission, uh, quest where I basically had to show my mastery of shooting balls and also using, oh, and also, um, attacking multiple enemies, and they taught you guard canceling, which is this thing where you, where you, uh, or not guard canceling, dash canceling, where you basically attack twice and then, and then change direction, I mean, dodge. I am good at descriptions. To basically make it so that your combo continues without stopping. I want that. Let's see here. And for doing that, I almost forgot to mention, I got the Adept Gloves, which basically give me um, more Royal Guard. Uh, for a time window for Perfect Guard, and it, allow it resets my Perfect Guard when I land a successful one. In other words, I can keep getting perfect guards quickly. I got the King's Ring. That's gonna be something nice. Okay, I see. I'm gonna want to. I wanna hit that over there. So to do that, I need to get my angle right. There we go. So basically, they give you a good way of practicing shots, because you're going to need uh, shots like that for stuff like this. Whee! Say hello to the hardest puzzle of the playground. Huh? Isn't this one quite trivial? Sarcasm, Johnny. I did it, guys. I solved the puzzle. And we entered a cave. Uh, a shadowy cave. A hedgehoggy cave, you could say. I think this is a time-based puzzle. I only have a limited amount of time to get there before it resets. Yep. But I get some shrimp risotto. Yeah, I'm playing a lot better today than I was yet last time. Last time I, I had a lot of problems just doing various... Uh, regular battle things sort of cause problems oh hey step it Burn. ha huh. all right oh there's a door here and again water in a cave below a lake we're literally below a giant lake so there is just no way you could make this work just imagine the water pressure who cares? It's just a game. We want an actual moon here. Physics still apply. Nerd. Oh, that's a big burn on her part. Guess we'll go this way. Let's go this way, and then I can hoppity hoppity hop this way, which means I go this way. Oh, uh, okay. You guys get stuck over there. I'm. I'll be fine. Okay, you're back. There we go. Not too bad. You know, so long as uh, my dudes can actually be in the area. Let's sneak past this. Aw, oh, fine. Ha! Oh, dang, I screwed that one up. 
Oh, nope. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Alright. Just keep working on, on paying attention to those projectiles. Breaking them when you can. Oh, that's it. Okay. And I get for that adventure... A trimmer engine. That's another gold item, which means it's going to be used for a trade at some point. More water. In this, is this water even real? Maybe it's virtual. Looks pretty real to me. Well, the augmented reality tech they're using is pretty advanced, so it's hard to tell. And it would allow them to break physics as they please. Monsieur Scientist, I propose we do an experiment. We kick you into the water repeatedly, just to make sure it's for you. That, that wouldn't even confirm anything. Maybe, but wouldn't it be fun? It would be fun. Alright, we have activated uh, platforms that I need to be a bit faster to get to. Hey, I'm stuck in the platform! <laughs> I don't think they intended for that to be a thing. Alright, now I gotta fight some edge. I need to be smart. This is the opposite of smart. But it all worked out. Ha! <laughs> there. See, things are going a lot better today than they were last time. Alright, one last little battle and it's against a bunch of dudes. Oh god, ugh. Wonderful start. Oh, nice. <laughs> I countered both of them. And that's what I mean. You gotta keep your eyes on so many things at times in this game. It's like, jeez. There we go. Oh, oh, one more. Thought I was done. Okay, now we're done. And the Humming Razor. Let's see. Humming Razor. Will it be better than the Prickly Bracer that I've had on forever? Uh, let's see. 40 more attack. Assault. Uh, I guess I'll take it, because that's 40 more attack, which is a big jump. Uh, more watery cave shenanigans. I was into... Oh. 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 Hey, guys. Did you know there's a sneaky little secret to this area? It's called... You can hop onto some of these, uh... These... These spikes. Specifically... Specifically this one. And then there. And then you can do this. And get over here! Ta-da! I got some cold platter. And then to get out, I gotta... I gotta... I gotta go here to here to there to... There we go. Alright, I'm out. There's an arrow over here. It's a little hard to see, though. And here we are. Some place. Ah, looky here. This is where you're... You're supposed to go there, but a bit later in the story. I, I'm here a little early. Also, there's uh, a wall you can't cross there. It's a little silly, but I mean... Ha! So, yeah. Uh, this is here for when I need to come back here. I shouldn't have to redo the fights, I would think. But hey, I uh, discovered that a little earlier than I intended. You know, just exploring, always a fun thing. Let's see, was the door here? No, the door was up here. Alrighty. Today has just been a very chill day exploring the new area, and I appreciate having an episode or two like that, you know? I got all the treasures in here. At least there's that. Also, I haven't really been showing me uh, going around collecting treasures or anything. Because I figure there's there's stuff I don't really need to show. You guys will have an enjoyable time. I'm hearing fireworks. Always a fun thing to hear. Randomly. Well, not really. Happy New Year, essentially. I hope you all have a lovely day. Etc. On your New Year's and other days. And he went that away. Let's chase the frobbit. 
What if I can get some info on it by um, uh, scanning it before I get too close? There we go. <laughs> it was a dumb miss, but I digress. Okay. Question mark. Lovely. Hey guys, look at chest. Yeah! Alright. Get some more items. By the way, I have not seen Henry this time. It's quite interesting, you know? You'd, you'd expect to see Henry again. Man, I sure wish I could jump around like that. Wouldn't that make exploration too easily? Too easy? I guess, but... How much more fun would it be? Well, at least we can do our regular small jumps, right? We regular jumping whenever we want. It's at least something. Leia's very humphy. Alright, we got a, a lovely little thing here. Gotta move it there. I'm gonna just break that because it exists. Yeah! Take that wall! I think it resets itself, so that was completely pointless. But I digress. I have made it over here. I can hit the button. Hi. Sup, you want to know more about the Old War too? It's a pretty dark time in human history. Various colonies waged war against each other. They taught us resources were the trigger, but I heard other stories too. Ah, oh, don't worry. It's all in the past now, like a thousand years past. So there was an old war a thousand years ago. It's a long time ago. It makes you wonder. And it was about colonies. So, for all I know, they could be referring to, like, space colonies and resources were a problem. And where we're still following the Frobbit, I would appreciate finding, like, a... Okay, I gotta sneak a, a shot into that window hole. There we go. I'd appreciate some kind of warping spot, but... Ah, that's exactly what I wanted. All right, I have unlocked this door, and that should probably do for today. Now I'm gonna head over here to make sure this thing gets unlocked, because it 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 gets un unlocked whenever you die in an area. It basically, acts like you never entered the area. Saving is simple; you just leave the area and then come back, and it will have remembered that in case you died. So anything you do, if you just leave the area and come right back, it'll remember it for then on, but you have to do that. So next time, we will continue chasing the dreaded Frobbit and completing the missions we need to unlock our means to go and do a raid, which will be a fun time with our guildmates. Speaking of our guildmates, let's see how they're doing. Hi. Hello, Leia. You've been gone for quite some time, haven't you? Anyway, Trotty and Emily have been at looking for you. Have you met them already? I see, so you should know about the raid. Well then, make sure to quickly collect that green seed shade. Also, it would be worthwhile to upgrade your equipment for the raid. You should check the new offers in Rookie Harbor. If you have the time, you can go for the trading equipment, but just buying the silver equipment work from the store works too. Hi. Leia, dear, it's nice to see you online again. Did you already arrive in Autumn's Fall? I remember that Emily and Trani finished the quest of the area recently. It's such a fascinating place, isn't it? Ruins from old constructions of the ancients everywhere. You really get at the feeling that there's a deep history to this place when you walk through it. Hi. Good day, Alea. Is something the matter? Are you by chance wondering about my temperature sense settings? I've set it to max. I feel this is the best way to experience the game. You really feel the freezing cold of Bergen and the heat of Maroon Valley. It's the most immersive experience. Plus, they put a lot of effort in developing the sense synchronization, and I'd feel bad just disabling it. Ugh. I would not want to experience the heat of Maroon Valley, thank you. Also, you'll notice Schneider and Buggy are level 50s, Helen and Beowulf are in the 70s, and we are in the 30s. Hi. Hi. How? How? Why? Why? How, why, how, by lay a wait? How, why, how, by lay a wait? How, why, lay a wait? Man, I wish I could have recorded that. Bye.
Buggy's a fun guy, isn't he? Alright, next time around we maybe complete the test of Autumn's Fall. It's not actually that big of an area, to be honest. As you can see, I think there's a couple more areas up north. I forget if I need a, a shade after a point. But yeah, that's what's going to happen. So till then, thank you all for watching. Have a lovely rest of your day.